Good evening, my name is Tyra Green, and today my presentation will be a persuasive speech. After listening to my speech, you, the audience, will understand that high school students should be able to grade their teachers. Let the, truth, let the future tell the truth and evaluate each one according to his work and accomplishments. Nicola tells them. All year spent towards an education, a teacher is evaluating the work and the academic skills set forth by the student. These evaluations decide if the student is qualified to move on to the following education level. These teachers are able to decide based on the student's behavior, academic levels, learning skills, and their mental and physical capacity. The teacher evaluations wouldn't be based on whether the teacher is likable. It would be conducting scientifically valid questionnaires that collect data about a variety of factors that might affect the teacher's performance, from how well she conveys the material and whether she encourages interest and a subject to whether a school fosters a sense of belonging for students. Far ahead of Minjo. Students should evaluate their teachers. This would help with their learning abilities, the performance of the teacher, and the future students that will have, the that, will have that class. Students who evaluate their teachers' learning abilities will increase. If students can evaluate a teacher on how well they teach the criteria that must be learned, then that helps the students know what the teacher is and isn't doing. By students assessing their teacher, it will help with the teacher's performance. The teachers will know what needs the students will have. This will allow them to set up different ways for the students to learn and, feel, and to feel comfortable. This will also allow the teachers to improve their methods of learning or to remain stagnant with their great work. Students if students were able to evaluate their teachers, this will help the future students. For example, if Ms. Great Apple was teaching in a way that is not learnable, that the students of that class will inform her of that in the evaluation. Since Ms. Great Apple is aware that her methods of teaching isn't suitable for the students, she would improve it and the following grade level entering her class would have a better chance of receiving the information better. Giving a letter A, B, C, or etc. tells you nothing about the person and what was done in that class. When you are labeled a letter based on your entire experience in a class, how is that supposed to be fulfilling or meaning, meaningful at all? If a student is judged by the teacher, then the teacher should also be judged by the student. We are all humans, and what other job would this, be, would this even be a question? For example, of course the public wants to judge the performance of a construction worker, because if they don't, they don't need to do well at the job, and the public are the best critics for the construction workers. Similarly, the student is the teacher's best critic, and feedback of the teachers help the teachers to improve their methods and realize that students are capable of teaching too. Thank you.